Hello friends, today we are fixing a broken blind. So one of the strings is broken on here. This one's kind of interesting, the, the front part it just kind of slides down on these little things here. Okay? Alright, and these ones on the sides just pop out and pull them out that way. So. There we go. Then we're going to pull our blinds out. Put this on the floor and see what we got to work with here. Okay, one second here. Okay, so one thing I noticed was <coughs> this string on the back part of the blinds was out and it wasn't attached securely and that's what's causing it to slip down. So if we feed that up, if you see back down in there, feed it up through this this hole right down there in the bottom. And in this um, <coughs> excuse me. In this little rotating thing, when you turn the blind handle, this rotates and that uh, turns uh, tilts the blinds one way or the other. As you can see, there's a little, um, right in front of my finger there, there's a little uh, kind of balloon shaped or bowling pin shaped thing. So this little brass end on there is supposed to slip up on there and lock into place. And somehow that came off of there. So all we're gonna do is try to um, move that up into there and lock it back into place. And hopefully that'll fix our problem. So let me try to do that here. Okay, so let's try to fish this up in there. Should be a fun one. Okay, so if you turn it sideways, it seems to go in there pretty good. Now I have to feed it up into that other hole there. It's like, uh, man, some tweezers would be great right about now. Okay, yeah, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get it up in there without some tweezers. That has a tough angle there. Um, oh, oh my goodness, it's so close. If I had, yeah, I'm going to have to get some tweezers here. So let me pause this. Okay, so kind of brought it up through there as much as I could and got some tweezers and kind of lock that in place. That should be right on that. And it should not come out of there, theoretically. All right, so let's see where we're at here. Is it still down a little bit? Looks like we have a broken cord on top of that, actually. So that was part of the problem, but not the entire problem, it looks like. So. Alright, give me a second here. Okay, so I tried it, and it was a little off. So I checked the other side, and when it's in the center, when the blinds are level, this is at the top, so you have to bring one cord around and lock it in place. Bring the other one around and lock it in the other place. I have both coming from one side. You can see how one's coming from one side, one's from the other. That's the way I want it, and this is where mine is. So I'm simply going to remove this one and switch it around. Take it around from the other side and lock it in place there. So. That's what we're gonna do. Pull this one out here. See, this one's coming around that way. That one's coming out, yeah. So this, this one needs to pop out. Okay. Pop out. Just simply pop it out. Okay. Easier said than done. It was pretty easy to say, actually. Okay, there we go, we popped it out. Now we have to bring it around to the other side and bring it out 
that way from the bottom part here. Uh, you know what? Let me just pause the video, work it around the other side here. Okay. Pop that out, brought it around here. Now I need to just stick it in this hole here, just like we did before, except from the bottom. So this is actually a little bit easier than the way I was doing it with the tweezers. Okay, so that right in place there, not too bad at all. Let me try it again here and see where it's at. Hopefully that was the fix we needed. Okay friends, let's put the blinds back up here. Yeah, we're gonna put it up the way we took it off there. So, we're gonna slide one side in. Okay, lock your plates on the side. Like that. And then this sliding slot on the rail, those they slide up on there. Have a great day out there. We'll see you next time for more how-to videos.